Well, I think he should have got more time since he really beat him into a coma. He should have got a little more, at least five years. I think the sentence is absurd. I mean, people nowadays for manslaughter, for child rape, for these horrific, horrendous crimes, they get nothing. They don't get any time. And then somebody that has an ounce of pot will get, you know, thrown away for life. It's crazy. The system is just crazy. That person deserves a lot more. It was a really brutal crime. That's incredible interpersonal violence there. But I don't think that two years in our justice system does anything to rehabilitate someone. I think that more of a focus on preventing such crimes from happening in the future and for actually like improving a person's understanding of things would be better than just two years stuck in jail. A lot of it comes down to the intent. Um, obviously, if it was just a fight and one person ended up coming out on top, um, and that's, I mean, it's obviously really unfortunate for both people. Um, but at the same time, like, it, you know, I don't think it's as malicious as, you know, a lot of other crimes can be. It wasn't like it was a, you know, a robbery or something else. I mean, basically, my understanding was it was, you know, a fist fight that, you know, somebody ended up getting their ass beat.